Heaven's first gift awaits you. I will remain here with the Watcher. I'm not letting the Horseman out of my sight. Where he goes, I go. Indeed. Go then, Darkling. Make for the tree. You will never reach the other side. Hurry up. And don't forget who holds the leash. Man, what a dick. Actually, I was about to say that. You totally beat me to that. In fact, those exact words. Um, but yeah, seriously, what a dick. Using the Mask of Shadows, we can now see that things that may or may not have been there, this will come into use later. But uh, yeah, I take a few minutes here to sort of just look around Eden, because it's just a beautiful, awesome area. Yeah, I mean, it's interesting that they kind of went with the whole, you know, it's all, it's all yellow and dying. Well, I mean, it is ancient. True, but I mean, I don't know. And it's also been sealed away. Yeah, I, it, it just... Hell, I mean, it's he even flying. He, he, <laughs> said he, did, he said he didn't leave it to rot, and yet here it is withering away. Well, which is that's different. Basically, that's basically one of the same. No, because it's not made of meat. That... You are so... Mmm. Cutscene. Would you serve in heaven, or rule in hell? The storm is coming, Uriel. Soon, I will need you at my side. I would follow you into hell, my lord. They knew. How did they? <laughs> the best laid plans. Or so the humans used to say. You... did this? You plotted and schemed to call us to this world. I simply took advantage of your initiative. No... I will consider this an offering, Abaddon. And you, my loyal servant, join me and take up the mantle of the Destroyer. No. Once the throne learns what you've done, you'll be cast down, dragged in chains before the council. You're already damned. So I offer you this choice. Would you serve in heaven or rule in hell? Now, return to Azrael. Persuade him to help us. Then, together. We will change the face of the universe. <laughs> Abaddon must be punished. He bends the law to his will, laughs in the face of the council. What proof do we have? The seals are intact. No doubt the angel had help, but from whom? Until we know, we must wait. His act breeds open defiance. The council weakens. How long before we are overthrown? We cannot stop Abaddon, but there are others who might, if they had reason. We cannot send the ball. Without proof, there is no justice, only murder. They will see no reason in this assassination. We will send one, for whom vengeance is reason enough. The blade is scattered. I guard the seventh seal. This world is ours. Heaven is ours. <laughs> you had to know it was a one way ticket. <laughs>
And now we have a piece of the sword that will be stabbed through our gut at some point in the future. Awesome! I can't wait. You know, fate kinda sucks. I agree. Let's change our fate and rebel. Let's join the destroyer. I agree. Let's do, go find Kane and see if we can make this coin land on its side. That's right. Let's wait. <laughs> wait, what? 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 <laughs> Abaddon is the destroyer. The Archangel? He was betrayed. He is only a pawn in some greater game. You must bring him peace. Peace? Abaddon is the destroyer. I'm pretty sure peace is off the table. Did you find any clues among the visions? A way to stop him? There was a sword. One which broke the seals, the Armageddon Blade. But after the seals were broken, Abaddon ordered the blade destroyed on the very anvil of its creation. Horseman, I fear the blade is lost to us now. It will be made again. What else did you see? Abaddon guards the seventh seal. He plots with others to storm the White Gates. Uriel will lead the Hellguard against him and fail. What else did you see? I saw nothing else. I will open the gate to return us. Once it is closed, the Garden and its secrets will be lost forever. When you are ready, I will begin. Well, since there's actually nothing for uh, left for us to do here, we can go ahead and take this wonderful gate. And guess what? Oh, look! It's, it's it's a serpent hole. But a different serpent hole, because it's yellow. And Uriel is, like, blue. popping around. Not red or blue. <laughs> also, that way is not exactly shut. You can return there if you need to. I did not know that, but there's nothing to actually go there for, as far as I know. Yeah, yeah, there is. Is there? <laughs> yes, there is. Well, shit. <laughs> I do like this one, though, because it's very direct. Unlike uh, some of the other ones, which one was just insanely overpowered, the other one is very windy and mysterious and sometimes weird, where you have to jump over pits. This one is super direct and kind of just goes straight there. And where, you may ask? To the Ashlands! Seek Ulthane. He will help you. He must help you. Abaddon will have scattered the sword's remains, hidden them where none that walk in the light could find them. The Shadow Realm. Yes. Use the Mask of Shadows. Assemble the Broken Blade. Then, return it to the Forge of the Black Hammer. When this is done, return to me. Perhaps I can serve you one last time before the end. Azrael, at any time you could have left me to my fate, dead in the tower, lost among the ashes of Eden. Why do you help me now? When this is over, the Council will see that justice is done. I will kill Abaddon, and all who schemed with him. We all must answer for our sins, Horseman. When the hour of my judgment comes, I will embrace it. Whatever the light decides. Go. Waste no more time on me. And tell Ulthane. He is the last hope of an old fool. The blade was scattered over this ruined world. Find the pieces. Forge them at the hand of the Black Hammer. So they decided to give us a freebie. Interesting. Hooray, Hooray fetch quest. It's interesting that uh, it's right here at the Stygian's lair. And yes, this is essentially a Triforce peace hunt from Wind Waker, something equivalent. But yeah, we need to find the seven pieces of the Armageddon Blade. And guess what? It's on the map, so that makes things a lot easier. Yes, it does. Um, just so you know, 
So I guess we could talk a little bit about this. Um, there is a big, big item hunt coming up. Um, I will be finding the Armageddon blade pieces because we have to. I will be finding the Abyssal armor pieces because they're awesome. <laughs> I'm also going to be finding the uh, some of the secret enchantment enhancements or the really good enhancements. Also, yeah, I decided to stop and show this off. This is a Shadow Realm specific air piece. It's kind of interesting. Anyway, who cares? Um, but yeah, what was that? What were we saying? Sorry. Oh yeah, that that that's necessary to get back up to talk to our Azrael. Right. Um, but uh, I, I just meant as in it, it was kind of a strange addition, uh, and I don't think they use them very much. Anyways, regardless, as of that, unless there's a really uh, interesting, I don't know, unless there's a really interesting upgrade or something, I probably won't show all the rest of the health or wrath upgrades unless you guys really want me to because they're not that interesting um, if you have any objections for that please let me know and maybe I'll go back and do the rest in a bonus video after we complete it or something but I think it's kinda of crappy and uninteresting <laughs> I <laughs> what do you think uh, I object don't do it <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah so anyways, guys, that's it for this week. We'll go ahead and see you next week with the beginning of the world's largest item hunt. <laughs> Yay, globe trotting! Woo! Alright, guys. Catch you later.